now we need to just have a clear, clear area. Up. If you want to and you find more, same thing, just put it on the side of the building and we'll okay. come back out. Oh, I meant both. The bomb guys were here and everything. <laughs> I, I love it. Welcome back to another episode of the Michigan Magnet Man. We are here in Ypsilanti, Michigan today. I'm doing some magnet fishing with Jason from the Motor City Magnet Fishers. If you have not, make sure you guys head over to his channel and make sure you guys subscribe as well. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get this magnet in the water. It's cool, what you must find it's just blows you your know. mind. It does. First find of the day, I got a catfish bell and a fishing lure. Oh yeah. And with that, I have so much fishing line, guys. that throw we pulled up a wheel myself a pair of pliers Jason's yeah. just got a weight lifting bar Corona. time to lift some weights dang dude stainless china <laughs> looks like we got a piece to a post and a battery all right guys Jason just caught a pipe bomb over here You can see the fuse coming out of it. There's caps on both ends of it. That is for sure a little pipe bomb. Yeah, luckily it's probably filled with black powder and the fuse is wet, which means all the black powder inside is probably wet. So it's probably, probably safe, but we're not the ones who are gonna make that determination. You can see the one that he found a little bit ago that was already blown up. This one is not. We're gonna go ahead and call. Hello, you have reached the city of Ypsilanti Police Department. If this is an emergency situation, please hang up 911. Metro dispatch, Maury. Good morning, Maury. My name is Jason. My buddy and I are doing what we call magnet fishing. We use magnets to pull garbage and debris and stuff out of the water, and um, I'm pretty certain we just pulled out a pipe bomb. Okay. And you said you're at Peninsula Park? Yes, sir. Right. I found, I found, uh, well, yeah, I, it was stuck to my magnet, and I moved it away from where we were. Gotcha. I did find one before then that looked like an exploded pipe bomb because it's all—it's a chunk of pipe capped off both ends, completely split down the middle and blown out, but it uh, wasn't 100% certain. And then we pulled this up and it was like, yep, probably going to need to get a professional here. All right, right. Okay, we'll be right there for you. Thank you, sir. Yep, you're welcome. Bye. Round two, dude. <laughs> this is the second week in a row that we've had the police come out for a bomb or an explosive in general. So now we're going to be waiting for them to get here. I'll let you guys know when they get here. Uh, we put it on the back side of the concrete blocks over so, here. The one that's all ripped open I found first and I, I thought maybe that's what it was. And then the other one was around the other side of the dock. The fuse is destroyed, more than likely it's completely full of water, but you know, I'm not a professional, so. You think it is? Mm -hmm. it looks like it to me. Mm. Detroit bomb squad, and he says, uh, Leave it alone, call the police right away. It's like, Yeah, I already did, man. Thanks. So, you want to do I mean, I don't know how we need to just have a clear, clear area. Up. Sir? Are you recording right now? Hey, yeah. Yep. All right, the bomb squad guys are here, guys. We've been asked not to record, so I'll try to get as much outside footage as I can for you guys. Let's see what they have to say. Now you got me intrigued. Now, what about the one that was exploded? You guys gonna take that one too? Yeah. Well, you can just go back down and get more, I'm sure. I, I, <laughs> I called my boss to see. I'm like, I'm sure they want it, but yeah, it was just really what um, used to be a pipe bomb. Yeah. Now, since you guys are here, do you want us to, to just go a few more times? If you want to. We have no problems with that at all. If you want to, and you find more, 
same thing, just put it on the side of the building and we'll okay. come back out. Oh, I meant both. The bomb guys were here and everything. <laughs> I, I love this. That's what that was. That was a, that it's, was like a, a it's like a, it's a light thing. Okay. Instead of, uh, they used to just shoot the ends off. Where's the powder that was in it? I mean, obviously it's going to be muck and nasty. Um, what's left? Right here? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Now just let us know if you do. Yeah, do, we'll do play in there. And okay, want all these that. guys and, and go from there. I mean, we yeah, just, just can't. Like, like can. hang. Well, out. I didn't know if you want to hang out for like 10 to 15 minutes while we just threw around the rest of that dock. Because you know, all we pulled in is just bars and those. Pulled in what? Just some pieces of bar, metal bar. Like there's a there's a weight bar down there that we pulled okay. out. And there's some, looks like there used to be another dock there. Is there some metal posts from that? And then the one that was already split open, yep. we found off to just, just on the left, and then the one that was still pulled, we found straight out, just a couple feet from the dock. Both with magnets, so? Yeah. Okay. Do you think they were fishing with them, or just? <laughs> Hard to tell. <laughs> could have been just. I'm not recording. I'm could, could be just fun. For so, them. Now, yeah. was that, that just seemed like a degraded uh, wick, or a degraded fuse to me. Is that what that was, or did they, was that actually a blasting cap? No, it was Okay, yeah, that's, that's what like I thought. Because basically, can't infuse. You know, like you can put out fireworks. I used to buy it from yeah. Menards. And there you go. Replace house. Yeah. Because um, I, I just saw that it was a two leads, and to me, it just felt like it was just degraded fuse, but it uh, made a little more high tech if they had blasting cap in there. Yeah, yeah. Yes, it would. All right, guys, we just finished up with the bomb squad. It was indeed a pipe bomb, and they went ahead and destroyed it and took that. Um, as you guys saw, they bagged it up at the end of there pretty crazy day we're gonna head on to the next bridge apparently there was another artillery shell and a gun that was found not too far from here that the police were letting us know about so we're hoping that we can go find some stuff over there so i'll see you guys at the next spot <laughs> i've got my second pair of pliers of the day these ones look pretty new let's see if they still work oh yeah these bad boys are coming home with me Whew. got myself a bike lock Right. Not the kind of scooter we used to catch him. Razor. That's all you, buddy. Is it a roll? No. <laughs> all right, guys, we're riding the scooter. Oh, it rolls. <laughs> Woo. Woo. <laughs> you can ride it. <laughs> a railroad spike. Oh, we got a big something out here, guys. All right, we got it. Great place for it. And we just pulled out this little girl's bike. It looks like it could be fixed up pretty easy, too. Looks like a bullet. It does look like a bullet. Oh, yeah, there yeah, it is. Yeah, I thought maybe it was a battery for a second. But no, that, that is a bullet. What else did you get? Oh, wow, a bunch of change. Dude, there's more in here. I wonder how old it is. I wonder what that was. Maybe an old uh, parking meter or something? I don't know. It's roached, guys. I'm assuming this was a nickel. Snip weight, 16 ounces. Good food cookie. Oh my god, it smells horrible. Oh my god, I just got a whiff of that. It smells like straight butthole. Oh, there's stuff in it. Oh, it's a spell thing, dude. No way. It's gotta be. Why else would it be full of railroad spikes? One, two, three railroad spikes. We got. Some other stuff. I mean, maybe it's not. Maybe it was a uh, seashell. That's weird. That is weird. Oh, God, that strip smells horrible. I just found some scissors. Another railroad spike. I lost to you. Another bike over here. I got my first really big pipe wrench. That is a big pipe wrench. That reminds me of working in the Navy. Well, that was number five. That one out there is number 81. <laughs> Jason just caught this sensor, I believe, and this another one right there. It's probably the old one. Yeah, got two combination locks on it. That is going to be all for today's video. What another crazy week. We got that pipe bomb pulled up and the bomb squad came out again. That's two weekends in a row that we've had that happen. 
It was overall a crazy day. It's a good spot here in Ypsilanti. If you guys have not, make sure you check out Jason at the Motor City Magnet Fisher. And make sure you guys hit subscribe and get those alerts turned on. I post new videos every single Friday. I'll see you guys next week. Bye.